I am now going to give you some technical details about the dry hopnik from Rolex. At Hoppebroi, the dry hopnik is used to dry hop our wood beers and collaboration rooms. The dry hopnik offers significant advantages, which I would like to tell you about. Firstly, the hops are placed in a tank and flushed with CO2 to remove the residual oxygen from the pellets. The whole tank is homogenized by a circulating pipe which draws off the beer at the tank cone and feeds it up back into the tank at the top with the help of a pump. The hops are then transferred to the line by overpressure in the cylindroconical hop tank. The pellets are crushed by the impeller of the pump which generates a very large surface area. This gives us a higher yield and we can reach the same result with less contact time in the tank. The other positive effect is that less tannins are dissolved due to a shorter contact time, thus imparting a purer, fruitier hop aroma to the beer, just as if you were holding a hop cone to your nose out in the field. In this way we can save 15% hops and achieve the same result. And we can work efficiently and quickly. When everything has circulated for an hour, the pipe is pumped empty with water, meaning there is hardly any loss. The whole system can be closed in itself and is very easy to CIP clean. It's great fun with excellent results. Give it a try.